also facing charges, Adis Madujanin, picked up last night after he crashed his car near the Whitestone Bridge. His lawyer says prosecutors won't let him speak to his client. They can make all the protestations saying that while they were speaking to him last night, he at some point said he doesn't want me to represent him. That's ludicrous. It defies logic. The feds have connected both men with accused terror plotter Najibullah Zazi, and in an indictment say Ahmad Zay gave false statements about travels to Pakistan and Afghanistan and his knowledge over whether a certain John Doe got military training. Both suspects are naturalized U.S. citizens. They attended Flushing High School and Queens College in addition to a local mosque. Do they have a good reputation at the mosque? Uh, can I say something, something like, uh, someone said good, someone said right. something like suspect. And however, we hear a stunning statement from someone who prays at the same mosque that these two suspects attended. The two men arrested and facing federal charges, 25-year-old Addis Medinjanin and 24-year-old Zarian Ahmed Zay, grew up and live in Flushing, Queens. Ahmed Zay's brother insists the FBI has the wrong guy. He's a nice guy. He's a good guy. Yeah. He's, he's hard, working, he's hard working, seven day he worked. But federal investigators say Ahmed Zay, a taxi driver married with two kids, and Meninjanin have close ties to their one-time neighbor, Najibullah Zazi, the alleged mastermind of an al-Qaeda plot to attack New York City and prayed at this flushing mosque, as does this man, who remembers seeing the pair but asks we protect his identity. Do they have a good reputation at the mosque? Uh, can I say something, something like... Uh, Someone said good, someone said right. something like suspect. Really? Yeah. Even in the mosque, some people suspected them? But, but don't show my, my pictures. The man says some men here have become radicalized. Something is wrong. In this mosque? Yeah, something is wrong. He says something's wrong at the mosque. Is now caught up in this investigation and, in fact, has been indicted. They are coming to his defense, but you also heard from a man who uh, prays at the same mosque who says there is something wrong at that mosque. We should ask, uh, add rather, that we asked to speak with the imam at that mosque, and he did not come out and speak with us.